you're way bigger than me, right? Like, yeah. you should say you weigh 260? 260. And people think that, like, muscles, like, mean something. <laughs> muscles don't mean nothing. Like, yeah, like, if, if I could jump on you, then then maybe. If I could hold you on the floor, sure. Yes. But in boxing, no, I know that's but not even, how it works. But even, but even, even in a street fight. I'd like, beat the they, f out of you in the street no, fight. No, I would, I would kill you, bro. <laughs> yeah, I would kill you. I would kill you bro. God, I love it. <laughs> no, like, for You real, think for real. at your weight. What's your weight? Damn it, I want his f***ing weight. No, so, so 150, around 150. Bro, I would maul you at 150. No. 100%. No. As confident as you are. Okay, so let me tell you something. 150. Let me tell you something. 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 You cannot take a punch, though. So, like, you're not used to getting hit. So. I've been hit, though. No, 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 no. No. Not by you. But you've been hit. Not by a professional boxer. And on top of that, without the gloves. Because a street fight, there's no gloves, man. It's straight, raw knuckle. By regular guys. Like, guys who don't even know how to punch. I know everybody thinks, like, oh, well, he's going to. If you grab me. Yeah, but you have to get to the point where you have to grab me. So but it's you're a gonna take fight. So, but you have to get to me though. Yeah, yeah. So in the process of you getting to me, you think you piece me up that fast? I'm gonna hit you so many God, times. I do this, I'm gonna bro. hit you so many I times. Do this. I wish they just had a fucking ring in the middle and said, "Let's try." Mm. So you know what though, Bradley Martin, because he's got so much weight to him, the amount of times David hits him, it would have to take a couple of hits. Yeah. For Bradley Martin to actually go down because of his weight. He needs but, to hit him clean as well. Yeah. But that being said, because he's got so much cardiovascular level, he will take down Bradley Martin. That's the thing. With a street fight, you just never know. Anything I, I can happen. I think he would. Anything. I think, I think uh, knock him beat out. him, knock him out quick. Of course, because he's a professional fighter. But if somehow Bradley somehow gets close enough and holds on to him and sub, it'll make things a lot harder. Mm. But... The percentage of that is very low. Ah! I'm gonna hit you so many times. Oh f no, no, no! That's I'm gonna I hit said. you so many times. By the time that you do get to me, I'm asleep. No, you may not. Even if you're not asleep, you might just be. I'm just gonna. You're not gonna want to fight anymore. I wish I could figure out a way to make this happen. <laughs> yeah, we're about, I just, I don't there's it. no way. No, you don't, bro. No, there's no don't. way at 150. No, you don't. I'm athletic as. No, I'll I jump on it. you. No. Nah, I think he'd fuck you up, Brad. No, no, like at like, one fifty, bro. At bro I didn't beat up. I didn't beat at up. At one fifty, you think I couldn't get your legs? I'm two sixty, though, bro. I'm two sixty. I look at those no. legs. They're tiny no, no, legs, you know, I know. Yep, tiny. Yep, they are Ooh. tiny. They are tiny. You think you beat me in a street fight? Nate you Diaz. Street fight? Yeah. You I love Nate Diaz. Podcaster brother. <laughs> I love, <it. laughs> I love it. So the answer is then yes, yeah. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Yeah, now you He's looking at him like, is this even a fucking question? What the fuck is this shit? You personal, though. By anybody, any size is like easy. No, I was talking about me. Yeah. Because I asked Devin Haney. Devin Haney thought the boxer, he thought he beat me in a street fight 150. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, he probably f you up too, though. You think so? <laughs> nah, you really but, think so. But, 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 no, no, I'm no, 260. I said probably. I'm 260, up. though. You think a 150 pound nah, dude? I think, I think, I think, uh. Realistically. You're talking about Devin Haney, the boxer. The boxer, yeah. 150. No, I think he'd fire. I think he'd fire you, but if you grabbed a hold of him, and you're talking about me too, so it's different. Like, look, you're it, different to me than that. I know. Yeah, for sure. Like, 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 if you fought Devin Haney, you got to get him good. You got to grab that little. Fucker. Oh, that's it. That's what I'm saying. That's the only way, and you literally need to like body slam the guy. But the thing is, Buddy Martin's got weight to him. He's got strength to him, and yes, he can, you know, do higher box jumps and everything. But I'm sure these guys can yeah, get course. out of a grapple. They're trained to know how to get out of this stuff. They do this professionally. The thing is, the UFC guys, yeah, but the boxing guys, not really. Hmm. They don't. Their fighting's not grappling. They're don't get me wrong. They will cl They'll clinch, and but it's not. They're not trained to be grapplers. But obviously, they're punching and their strength and their overall athleticism is next level. Hmm. Yeah, 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 and yeah. that's it, right? You have a hold of Devin Haney, he's probably most likely dead. Yeah, yeah, but you. <laughs> you grab a hold of me, you're dead. <laughs> Straight up. I love it. I think I might be able to get you. Yeah. Yeah. You won't. <laughs> Dude, I fucking love Give it. Give it a try, though. Oh, my God. What, one of these that's days. That's the difference. What's that? <laughs> I said, that's the difference. What's the difference? That fucking... Jiu Jitsu versus boxing, what are you gonna do? You're gonna grab that phone and smash him. You grab a hold of me, big yeah, trouble. Yeah, yeah. yeah, different. One of these days we should fuck around though. Tomorrow, tonight. Bro, I'll, I would love it. Right to now. After this. Oh, no, I don't wanna hurt you. Uh, I, I, honestly, part of his podcast, Bradley's, he needs to have some sort of ring set up and say, let's try. 
Like that would just add so much level to his podcast. Fight. You won't. <laughs> you won't though. I gotta give you a little sh with challenging Nate Diaz and Haney. Right? <laughs> oh, like yeah, what do you think about it? Um <laughs> <laughs> being full transparent, those guys would f up. The real question is though, who wins the street fight, me or you? Oh, he's that's the everyone. real question. Is it though? That I, is. I trained all my life. Dude. I know, but like you're getting <laughs> older guys. now, dude. How old are you? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm 40. You know, but it's I feel like, like your knees hurt. Uh, no, I, I I don't have any <laughs> injuries, but I would like to think I could beat you up. The problem is, it's like, I mean, you're a big dude, so it's like some shit could happen for street sure. Street fight. Street, but. Uh, you keep saying street fight, but what do you think you're gonna like hit you with curb a stomp me or some shit? Like just like <laughs> WWE, you know? But I would like to think like you know I have my ten thousand hours sparring big yeah. world class guys. Yeah, I mean you I fought big dudes. Yeah, yeah, heavyweight, like yeah, top ten in the world. Yeah, you know, it's it's like it's a little different. Now even though Big Brendan over is, so I'm gonna just like dude, cause you just lay on top of a hundred twenty five pound guy. Can't mm, what, really not 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 the elite guys. Dude, I want to find that mother. I want to find this guy you're talking about. DJ. I want to find him. Yeah, I'll text him. My right. text him. I want to try. I'm not going to fight him, fight him in a street fight. I want to just lay on top of him. I just think 150. Like someone 125, though, that 125 guy. Mighty Mouse would. Like, You're talking about like the best of all time. Okay. You, you wouldn't be able to touch him. Best ever in MMA? Ever in MMA. It's hard to say. There's a lot of candidates. You know, I've always said Mighty Mouse is one of my best bets. Because he was so goddamn good, and he's still so goddamn good. We're going to do some reactions to Mighty Mouse in the future. For sure, because I don't know. Very him. strong, lightweight. Mm. Now, but now he's fighting in 1FC. But he was a flyweight champion for a long time. And his he was the highest level of expression of mixed martial arts ability that I've Fuck ever seen. Fuck it out. Not, not, not the elite guys. Dude, I want to find that mother. I want to find this guy you're talking about. DJ? I want to find oh, he's reacting to it. Oh, shit. Let's see what he's saying. <laughs> hey, he's laughing with chest. <laughs> he's like, nah, that was buddy. Psycho laugh. Yeah, he's laughing. I, I, I want to just lay on top of him in jujitsu. So, like, I, I did this. DJ, what's, I mean, what do you, what do you, what do you, what's your, what's your thoughts on that, dude? How's, is that dude just yeah. gonna get Go. on top of you, like he said? And sound like he was trying to do some kinky things, but talk to me about yeah, it. I, I, <laughs> I know when he said he wants to get on top of me like that, I'm like, damn, dog, you ain't Destiny, you ain't my wife. That's the only person I let on top of me like that. Damn. It, it's funny, you know. It, it's you know, he's 265, he's a bodybuilder, so obviously he's got the weight advantage. But at the end of the day, you know, that's the beautiful thing about grappling. It's not about weight, it's about technique. I'd really be mm. mad if I don't ask you this question. <laughs> but, <laughs> or they'll so, be mad when I ask you this question either way. I think you know what question is coming next. Who wins in a street fight, me or you? If it's not like somewhere super, like a room like this, I wouldn't like my odds as much. But like a wide open space, I'm 100% not going to get as tired as you. It would yeah. be very hard for you to just grab a hold of me. I've been defending that for the last 12 years, not letting people grab a hold of mm. me. But no one has tried as strong as you. Um, but even if you did just grab a hold of me, there's, you know, there's other issues you got to worry about. Don't let me fucking grab your neck at all. Don't let me take your back. I, I could probably, I, I honestly, I got a couple little takedowns that I'd probably be able to get get to your back and choke you that's how i would have to uh, have to guess what he's think? proper imagining it like what would happen yeah that's the trying thing. to picture the scenario even if a bradley's able to get someone like that on the floor he's got to worry about submission he's got to worry about yeah. the guy gets around him and gets on his back he's finished and that's he don't, what I'm saying, like, he won't have to defend it he's got the weight on him but he's not a professional fighter. I think the only way Bradley would be able to like, win in one of these if he somehow grabs hold of someone, like it's kind of like tossing around. He mm. somehow get lands on top of the guy where all his body weight's on top of the guy, and then he somehow uses like that advantage to like pick the guy up and slam him into the concrete, or like you know what I mean, hitting him with the ground. Mm. That's the only way. Like, but it's it's such a messy situation for that to happen. The odds are very low. He should make it happen one day. They should just get a ring. Like yeah. in this podcast, have a ring in the middle. Say, you know what? Let's All that this. talk, let's do it. Let's see what happens. The streets are different though. You you get it, get his back. He can slam you on the concrete. That's true. That's, that's what I was true. saying. Jump backwards and slam me. I'm not in a good position unless I... Yeah, I don't know. That's a good point. It's true because they're so light as well. And they're strength. gonna have more impact. Yeah, yeah big time. Yeah, and he's, he's heavy as fuck. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't want to test it. I wouldn't want to fucking do it. <laughs> yeah. so I, do it. I, I like you a lot. It would like be scary. Lot. I would be scared. Yeah. I'd be like, but that would also probably make me more dangerous. Being like, it's if it's actually life or death, 
Yeah. That's... Pro- you know, I feel like I have, I'd like to think I have the skills to be able to kill you. Yeah. <laughs> you know who he needs, he needs to ask this question to you? Hamza. Oh. He'll be like, bro, I kill you. I kill you right now. <laughs> right now, my <Martha. laughs> Okay. I got a couple of tactics, bro. Yeah. I got a couple of strategical tactics. What's, what would be your move to beat me in a street fight? Besides try to knock me out, obviously. No, nah, I, I wouldn't even try to knock you out because that's not my thing. My thing would probably be let you swing, let you miss. Especially a guy your size, I would think that I would be a little bit more agile. Yeah. Yeah. Let you swing because more than likely you're probably thinking this little motherfucker. You'll probably swing something and you're like, I'm about to clean his clock. <laughs> I would I'll be on your back like this. You I ever, would kick you, you. You ever watch X-Men? <laughs> You yes, watch X-Men? yes, yes. You know Nightcrawler? Yes. You ever yes. see him bamp? <laughs> That's how you think he's going to be? Just right on your back. No. Right dude. on your back. Strangling while you're just like, how did he get here? <laughs> and then as you're waking up, you're like. That an assassination by this bad. Help me. <laughs> just, what you say is black. Sleeping. No, bro. <laughs> I kick you. I wouldn't even try to punch you. Oh, that's your well, yeah. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Yo. What happened to his 260? This guy picked no, him up. No, but this guy's heavier than he must be like a strong man. He must be a strong yeah. man because he picked him up like he's a cookie. Baby. Yeah. What's going on? Security. Let me tell you. Oh, my. Oh, there we go. That was good technique. See, although he's got the strength, as soon as a bit of technique gets involved, that's basic security guards. What the fuck's a professional UFC fighter gonna do? Yeah, but that's the thing. Bradley Martin doesn't have technique. Yeah, of course. But he this says is, this he's is the got, thing. He's been hit before, but it means nothing. Yeah, yeah he's but not been hit by a professional fighter. He, look, the security guard got him running, mm. like and struggling. Let alone these guys. Yeah, these are trained for it every day. <laughs> oh, he's got his back. <laughs> Nightcrawler. <laughs> <laughs> He's about to do the night crawl on him. <gasps> Choked him out. <laughs> and he got spanked on the way. 260. 260, done nothing mm. there. <laughs> oh. Oh, what? Right you good? He yeah, felt that. <laughs> I got rocked. You got it. That was like a good punch. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good punch. That 260 made him crash land, boy, because mm-hmm. he literally fell with his body weight. That'd be good, though. <laughs> Round two. <laughs> See, Bradley Martin's trying so hard to go for the legs and pick them up and slam them. But a guy that knows how to resist that, like him, you could tell by his stance, he can't pick him up. because. And st- also, he's putting so much effort into it. You look at, hear the way he's breathing He's exhausted. As well. he's he this guy's calm. He, yeah, because he's, he, he's letting yeah. him get tired and he's literally just resisting. He's holding like he's a doing. baby's head. Dare there, child. <laughs> Gonna go sleep soon, don't worry. It's all technique. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and he, yeah, just like that. Okay, <laughs> 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 I'm so <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>